Hey everyone, and welcome back to another Outriders MGM video. Today, I bring to you the Devastator. In other words, the absolute bullet sponge. Before I get into the meat of this class, I just want to say that my Devastator is not where I want it to be in terms of the build that I have right now on screen for you. I've sunk a lot of hours into this game, but mainly on my Technomancer. I have every legendary in the demo, which is also just on my Technomancer. I feel like I have more than enough knowledge to present to you a really killer build for the Devastator as this class really knows how to create tons of destruction. So first, let's start with the skill tree. Now it goes without saying that we won't be spending too long on this as the demo only gives us access to two skills, therefore there isn't much you can do with this. However, because this build is mainly going to be utilizing shotguns, I'd recommend you put your second skill point that you obtain when you reach level 7 into the shotgun adept slot. This skill increases your shotgun weapon damage by 12%. With this Skills now covered, let's take a look at the three Devastator abilities that we're going to be using for this build. The first one is called Earthquake, which sends out a directional earthquake that inflicts damage and causes enemies to be interrupted regardless of what they're doing. The second ability is called Golem, which covers your character in an armor made entirely of rock. This reduces all damage taken by 65% for 8 seconds. And lastly, we have Gravity Leap which is my favourite out of them all. Gravity Leap launches your character into the air with rock forming all around your character, giving you the control to slam down onto enemies within a certain radius. This also deals huge amounts of damage and interrupts enemies too. Like I said in my opening statement, the gameplay in the background isn't going to show off the full potential, specifically because the legendary that you absolutely have to use for this Devastator build is the Airy Master, which is a legendary shotgun. My Technomancer currently has this, and until the full game comes out, I can't really swap my- My Technomancer currently has this, and until the full game comes out, I can't swap my weapons across to show you. I do, however, have a written review of the Airy Master, which you can go ahead and check out on the MGM blog post website. Link will be in the description. Now, let's get into why this build is so strong. The Devastator class builds health back from enemies that you shoot within a close radius to you. This alone encourages you as the player to get in as close as possible to your foes in order to take advantage of that lifesteal. The Golem ability that shields you is only useful for close combat, which again encourages you to go into the thick of battle and absorb that damage as much as you can. And of course, you have the Gravity Leap, which is going to lunge you into piles of enemies. This also deals huge amounts of damage like I stated earlier, and you're instantly going to get life steal back from this. And this is now where your shotgun comes into play. Once you've popped all of your abilities, it's time to open fire, and what better way to do that than to use the one weapon that screams close quarters combat, your shotgun. Now of course, you can use any shotgun for this build, but the reason why I specifically say to try and get your hands on the Airy Master is because not only is it the best legendary shotgun in the demo, but its perk levitates enemies into the air for free damage, which is a huge boost for the Devastator class. Plus, if you're able to hit two enemies within the spread of the Airy Master, then you'll actually levitate two enemies at once rather than just one. This literally means free damage, which is also free lifesteal. If you utilize this properly, then you're basically unstoppable at this point. Point. The Airy Master helps so much for that. The other legendary shotgun in the demo is called Golem's Limb, which if you're able to get that too, also works. In fact, I'd go as far to say that running dual shotguns for this class would still be really insane because it's literally what the Devastator is built for. Let me know what you think of this build in the comment section below. What would you change and what would you add to this? Stay safe out there guys and take care of yourselves.
have ruined this place. Reminds me of that mission to Damascus when we rescued those diplomats. I had to save your ass from that machete wielding mob. <laughs> More like the time I had to save your sorry ass from that redneck assholes in DC. Those missions felt like we were fighting for a reason. But this shithole, it's never been worth fighting for. So what's it all about for you then? Just trying to live another day. Moss. We're barely holding on. It sounds like I chose a good day to wake up then. Shit, be careful. 